So what React.js does is that on a production website, this is a server, this is a client, and this server could very well be just a CDN, right? It need not to be a server like EC2 or anything. It could be just a CDN as well. CDN is just a dumb server, which just knows how to present files, right? It does not know how to compute and stuff. This CDN delivers this client a single file on the handshake, right? Index.html. Now this index.html actually contains inside its source code, it contains something known as bundle.js. Now this file could be named pretty much anything, but I think the default name for React is bundle.js. And this bundle.js actually contains a lot of JavaScript code. This index.html right here is pretty much blank. It has to deliver a JavaScript file to the client and the client has to execute this JavaScript first. So it has to execute this JavaScript first in order to understand what the page should look like. This is how very simply React.js works.